Up until today, I've only driven this car on the street, so I was pretty excited to see how it'd do at an autocross. I went to register my car and nobody knew what class to throw me in, so they threw me in the Extreme Street A class. But after looking at the rules, I was actually underweight for the XA class. I was actually underweight for the more extreme XB class even. I only weighed 2,100 pounds. It was already hot at eight o'clock in the morning. It was only gonna be hotter when it ran into the third heat in the afternoon. It was gonna be over 90 degrees. But when my time came, I slapped on a helmet and went out. My first run did not go smoothly. It was time for my second run. That run was about 45 and a half seconds, but my next four runs steadily improved until I got my best time of 44.1. That put me at the top of my class, beating a Lexus ISF and a Ford Mustang. I was also beating a C5 Z06 that was running in the same heat as me. A couple cars that were running faster than me were an M2 and a Lotus Evora S, and one of the fastest cars of the day, I don't think it was the fastest, but it was close, was a Model 3 Performance, and that ran about a 36.6 so significantly faster than my 44.1. By the end of the day, my clutch pedal had stopped bouncing back and I realized I had boiled my clutch fluid. So I'm gonna have to flush that again to get all the air out of the lines with the higher temp fluid. Now my car is not really set up for autocross. I just decided to go out there and have some fun. But I have some pretty narrow front wheels that are only 215 tires. They are street tires, not slicks. I run relatively low camber for the street. Again, it's not really set up for the course, but did pretty good and I had fun overall. I definitely wanna do some more events, so. Maybe this is a good excuse for me to start fine-tuning the car and just get some experience behind the wheel. 